my name is Lisa and I love everything hair, skin, nails, and makeup. Most of all subscription boxes. And I have the infamous Ipsy versus a BoxyCharm. The, I'm going to do the, uh, oh, showdown, you know. Uh, <laughs> um, but I'm going to do the uh, Ipsy Glam Bag Plus versus the base box because they're pretty much the same price these days, you know. Instead of doing BoxyCharm Premium and Ipsy Plus, you know, or Ipsy Premium, Ipsy Plus. <laughs> but yeah, so base box and premium or plus, <laughs> sorry, base box and plus because they're like the same price and I believe you probably get about the same amount of products. So we are gonna do, we're gonna do my Ipsy first. And I'm sure you probably all have seen this bag so far, you know, this month or whatever. It's, I mean, I like the, the pattern, the material, not the material, the pattern. <laughs> But I hate these bags. I shouldn't say I hate. I dislike these bags. I don't hate much. There are a few things in the world that I hate, but hate's a strong word, so I try not to use it. So, what did I get? Okay. I know that I picked... What did I pick? I don't know what I picked. Okay. I know I picked this. This is the LYS Beauty... I believe it stands for Love Yourself. One of my wonderful subscribers. I think it was, well, I'm not gonna say her name because I might be wrong, but I, I'm pretty sure I know who it is. And I talk to her all the time and she's wonderful. But I don't wanna give her a shout out just in case it's not her and somebody's like, hey, I told you that. But <laughs> anyways, what is this? I forgot. It is a satin matte cream blush. I'm not a big I'm not big on uh, cream blushes by any means, but I, uh, sorry, my eyes have been watering so bad tonight. I couldn't put my lashes on or anything. Wiping my makeup off, everything, my eyes are just crap tonight. But anyways, I'm not big on cream blushes. However, I want to start using them a little bit more. This is what it looks like. And it is in the color, can confident <laughs> so I can I can read it's just I don't have my glasses so but yeah I think that's really pretty a little dark but mauve -y. you know it's pretty all right next thing I picked oh okay this is this doesn't make me very happy but I am happy but I'm not <laughs> And reason being is because I picked this Fenty Beauty. Uh, whoa, shit's getting out of hand. Fenty Beauty, what is it? Stun a Lip Paint, okay? And I got in the color Uncensored 01. I have not tried this, but I heard like probably maybe two years ago, it was like a serious rave. Okay, it looks like this. Very pretty. We will swatch it real quick. This is supposed to be a 12-hour uh, lip paint. Oh, it's beautiful. Whether it transfers or not, I don't know. But it is supposed to wear for 12 hours. And from what I hear, it truly does. Like, you can eat, you can drink, you can do whatever you like, and that's just going to be on your lips. However... What, there's three products here that they picked for me, okay? You normally pick your products and then they pick products for you. I have another one. And this one is in the color Uncuffed. So I picked a product and then they picked the same product for me, just a different color. Like I said, not very happy about that because it's the same fucking product. However, I am very happy to have this. Because, like I said, they're supposed to wear for 12 hours. I like both the colors. Uh, they're great to add to my collection. It's just, you know, it's the same product. They screwed up. Because if it was something I didn't really care for, and then they gave me another one, I'd be really pissed. But, like I said, I'm happy to have them. 
I've never tried them and I do love both the colors. They're beautiful at this. Isn't that pretty? So yeah, I'm happy. I'm, you know, picking up what I'm laying down. I'm gonna take them out of the box though. Okay, leave them up here. Now, next thing they picked for me is from Earth Harbor. And it is the Cloud Burst. It's a balancing gel hydrator. Marine prebiotics, sorry, probiotics. Don't have my glasses. Uh, herbal complex. Don't really know what that means. What it's gonna do for me. But it is a beautiful bottle. Okay. And last but not least, they picked for me from Dermalectus, I think it says. <laughs> I can't see shit without my glasses up close. Far away I can. Okay, dermalectives. But some of this is such a small writing and it's black on top of this dark that it's really hard to see. But it is a salt, soft salt glow. Soft salt glow. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's open it. <laughs> Safety seal. Let's open her up, shall we? Ooh. Got some on my hands. And it smells... I don't know. I'm not going to open it all the way because I'm not using it right away. But it's like a gel, you know? Oh, it smells... Okay. It doesn't smell very sexy, I'll tell you that or a real feminine. It smells very <sighs> herbally, essential oily, but not like a good, no, I won't say good. Not like a great essential oil, you know, not like a feminine. I think it's almost more masculine to me. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I think my allergy is going crazy because everything is itching. My eyes are watering. <sighs> Just not good. Okay, so that is my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. Now we will dive into the boxy charm base box. So, real quick, I'm getting around for to do this video, right? I didn't do my hair. I said screw. It. I pulled it up to do my makeup and started falling. And I'm like, you know what? Whatevs. Nobody's gonna give a shit anyway, right? I'm sitting here and I've got three doggies in the room with me and I'm almost done. I was trying to put lashes on, you know, but that didn't pan out because my eyes won't stop watering and they won't stick. And I get a whiff of shit. My six month old that is potty, potty trained. <laughs> I knew it too. I could, I could smell it. And I looked at her and I said, did you poop on the floor? And she put her head down. I walked in the bathroom. She not only shit, but she pissed on my floor. I was so upset. I'm like, you ruined my video. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm not kidding about the bathroom situation, but I am kidding that she ruined my video. <laughs> she was very upset. I was very upset. I went, I let her out. All is good now, but wow. What an ordeal right before I start my video. Kids, you know what I mean? <laughs> okay. Back to the task at hand. Uh, under your spell is our theme, if anybody cares. I really don't. I, I like the card for the products. It tells you about your products and how much they cost. Let's hope I can read it. I think I'll be able to, but, you know, we'll see. Okay, first and foremost, we got Flu and B. Eyes, eyes, baby. Anti-aging eye cream. Everybody always loves an eye cream. At least I do because I need it. Okay. Come on out. Nice glass bottle. And a dark bottle, which is good. Helps keep your stuff good. You're a queen bee, it says. This little dealio. Okay, let's see. Do, 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 do. Fle and bee. This retails for $26. It's a rich eye cream that will awaken your eye area, help to firm your skin, and reduce the appearance of dark circles, wrinkles, and puffiness. Who doesn't want that? Know what I mean? I'm not going to open it because I'm not using it yet. 
Okay, next thing we got is from Tahitian Breakfast. It's a dewy, <laughs> sorry, dewy collagen face primer. And I've seen a lot of people got this. And this retails for, let's see, whoa. Oh, it's from Dew of the Gods. I'm sorry. And it's a Tahitian breakfast, I guess. But yeah, the company is Dew of the Gods. I've had their eye patches before, but I, and it may be a primer. Like, not this one, but a different one. And I think that's all I've tried from this brand. And I love their eye patches. I think they're great. I mean, I got no complaints. And I think the primer, whatever I have, I didn't have any complaints with that. I remember going, oh, this is pretty good. You know what I mean? Okay. Let's take a look. It's like, ooh, it's a really pretty, pretty dealio. Oh, safety seal. I'm not going to take the safety seal off because I, you should see my freaking primer drawer. Yes, I have a primer drawer. It's insane. There are, um, there are some concealers in the drawer as well, but it, my primers take up more than half the drawer. <laughs> so yeah. Okay. Next thing we got is by, oh, let me open it first. I appreciate that they put this liquid in, what is on my face? I got plastic that just flew on my face. <laughs> no one can see it. Anyways, I appreciate that they put the liquid bottle in this and sealed it because I have had things leak before. This is from Playa. Playa. Uh, Manoy Milk. It's a leave-in conditioner. Smooths frizz and softens strands. God, I'm doing good. I'm on a fucking roll. It says Coconut Milk Manoy Oil. And I have not tried this. I've seen a lot of people get these in their boxes, but I personally haven't tried it. I haven't gotten it. It smells like freaking coconut oil. It truly, truly does. Let me wipe this out. Okay. Yeah, it smells good. I like it. Hopefully it works on my fine, thin, shitty hair. Okay, we have two more products. Okay. Oh, how much is that? That is, let's see, it goes for $24. Yeah. And I basically just told you about it. So is the Tres Luce Gl Beauty Luce Glow. I don't know if I say any of that right, but I'm guessing. I'm guessing. I know a lot of people that love this brand. I... I don't know. I, I can take it or leave it, honestly. It uh, just, to me, it's not that great. And I think the packaging is beautiful blue, but yet it's kind of boring. Like, I don't know. I don't know. That's just me. But it looks like it's a highlighter and a highlighter. Okay, let's swatch a little bit. Got this one. This one, oh my God, those look exactly the same. Almost, like truly almost exactly the same. Okay, these two right here, this one are these two right here. Like those are, you know, the bottom two. They don't look the same in the pan, but on my arm, they look the same. And then we have this one and this one, which they're okay, I mean, I don't know. I wish I wouldn't have swatched them because I could put them in a giveaway. But I did. Screwed up. What do you do? Okay. We've got one more thing. One more thing. Now I've seen everybody got this. And I am so happy that I did too. God, my eyes look so weird without lashes. I mean, I put mascara on, but I've been wiping it off because before I started this video, I was like constantly doing this. It was so bad. But you can see a little bit of mascara. What did I use? I used, uh, it's a pretty good mascara. I like it. Oh, it's the Huda Beauty Legit Lashes. And I used the volumizing end because there's a volumizing end and a curl and lengthen. So I use the volumizing. So my lashes don't come straight out like this, you know. 
Even though curl and lengthen, that would be curl. What the hell's volumizing? Make it more? Yeah. Makes it look like you have more lashes than you do. Okay. Oh, how much was the Trace Lucid Beauty? Beauty. $26 for that highlighter palette. Hmm. Maybe 18 it should be. I don't know. That's my opinion. But anyway, we got the Ciate London Spice Palette. And this is such a nice palette. It's like just beautiful, isn't it? It's so classy looking. And it's heavy. It just, it feels luxe for sure. If I can open the fucker. <laughs> oh, yeah. He, oh, it's even more beautiful in real life. OMG. Damn, I'm digging this. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, so freaking stunning. I just love it. Now this runs for $39. I can see that because like I said, it's this is Lux, baby. Oh, what do I swatch? Okay, I'm going to use my left hand because I got so much on my right. I am not good with my left hand though, so I'm just warning y'all. Then, two. These are not going to be the greatest swatches. I won't lie because a I've got long nails. Two, I'm just not the best swatcher. <laughs> I'm drooling out the side of my mouth. <laughs> my hair is getting in my lipstick. What the fuck? Okay. Last one. I mean, I didn't. I, it's not the last one. I just didn't do them all. I did these right here. Like I said, these are pretty shitty swatches, but aren't they pretty colors? You know, maybe I'll do, maybe for you guys, I'll do two more. Being so I've got enough, you know, uh, room on my hands. Okay. We'll do this one. I love this palette. I cannot wait to play with this. Anybody wants to see me do a look with it? Please let me know and I will totally do look. Oh God. Okay. This is a beautiful shimmer in another beautiful matte. Oh, so pretty. Oh, I am. I'm going to wear this every day for all winter. No, I'm really not. But <laughs> I feel like I want to. Okay. So that is my base box. Deal is. What is this? Fleur and B. Where does that go? Shit. Oh, okay. It goes in the name. So we get... Oh, that... Yeah, I told you how much about this. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four, five items in the Boxy Charm. And we got five items in the Ipsy. I personally like the Boxy Charm better. Even though, like, there's a few things that I could take or leave in the Boxy Charm, which really is just the Trace Loose... Beauty and then the choice of <laughs> that's probably it. And in the Ipsy, I mean, I like everything, and I just the two same products bug me. I don't know, I, I think it's kind of a wash, honestly, this month because I really like most of the products in them. I mean, I, I dig these. I cannot wait to try these. And if they really, truly last 12 hours, what the fuck? That's, it. That's unheard of. It's insane. It's awesomely insane and unheard of, though. So, yeah, I think it's kind of a, a tie this month. I really can't. But if if anything, I think I like the box charm a little better because the Ciate London is to fucking die for. So, that's my boxes. Uh, I know I haven't been putting out a lot of videos lately, but I will start again. It's just sometimes I, you know, sometimes I just need a little help saying, hey, where's your videos? Um, we want to see them, you know. I've been stuck not being able to get to a thousand subscribers. I've been stuck at like 983 or something forever. And it just sometimes it gets like... A little down, you know, like, mm, I'm not going anywhere. I don't know if people really like these. So, you know, but that that's just on some days. So other days I'm like, I don't care. I love doing this. Like, I don't care if I have two views. I just enjoy doing it. But anyway, enough of me rambling and sobbing about shit. Uh, hope you like this video. Thank you for 
for coming. Thank you for staying. Thank you for watching. Good morning, good evening, good night, whatever time it is, wherever you're at, whenever you're watching this. And I will see you next time, hopefully. Please subscribe and click on all notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads. Bye.